Hello everyone. Uh, I would like to share with you this uh, presentation talking about the unlock opportunity of investment of Dubai. I will be with you, Ibrahim Abdul Hadi, and we'll take you through this presentation that to explain more about the opportunity and how we help our customer and investor to achieve their result. So to talk about it more, as I told you, we are looking an opportunity um, to talk about the UE real estate market. To talk about it more, we'll talk about the regulation, what the demand is going on, uh, what's the investment of uh, potential, and to understand more about that market. So my background, here in the UAE for the past 10 years, I was uh, working in multiple family businesses and managing multiple portfolio in real estate and stocks. So because of that, I will share with you my experience and how we achieved my uh, investors, their result. So we will talk about it. So since 2014 till today, we see we saw a lot of upside down in the real estate market, but, but for the past three years, it was going uh, increasingly rapidly up uh, for different scale. <clears throat> to talk about the market size and growth, we'll need to talk about what the value and what the contribution of the government that affect and what the real estate contribution in UAE uh, market to talk about it more so if we see for the past year January till October we see how is the market compared to the last year is performing so we will see it's in in August it jumped 52 percent compare what's going on uh, and that it's highly value to be considered about it that's mean a lot of project is launching, uh, has been launched and already sold, and a lot of transaction is happening on the secondary market. What's the real estate contraption to UAE market economy? So it's only 5.5%. Uh, as we mentioned earlier, and everyone knows about it, that UAE is non-oil uh, production com uh, country like other GCC had, but our UE is focused mostly uh, in the uh, tourist about the attraction it's happening and uh, activities that's happening in all over UE and that's what's their target. What the key market trends to talk about the current trends in the UE market and what's changed consumer performance and preferences and demand that is affecting that real estate market definitely. So about the why the question is why the current real estate market is perf the performance of it is very demanding and what's the reasons that affect this. So to talk about it more is, first of all, the initiative of the government to make UAE is attractive a country in all over the world. You have multiple uh, tourists in the, from different nationality, uh, as well the supporting from the UAE government to support the market and support um, the industry as well to be attracted by international exhibitions and events like COB, Expo, uh, JITEX, and the uh, air show and multiple events and exhibition to be at to be and asking to be in Dubai. Uh, as well, the developer are launching project with flexible payment plan with collaboration with well-known brands like Jacob and Go, Armani, Bugatti, and Elisab and multiples as well. And as well to be 
a country for initiative for everyone want to to have and start their business in UAE, like in terms of blockchain, crypto, and as well, we mentioned that all reasons to be, to let different nationality billionaire and uh, to move to Dubai. The consumer preferences is the location. They need to be surrounded by certain areas in Dubai that has a huge demand. Uh, the amount is that around that areas what and the ROI and what technology and that um that project is providing and flexible payment plan. To talk more about the investment potential, about what's the opportunity that available for investors, what the ROI they will they will generate when they invest in Dubai and what the emerging investment or hotspot. So as I told you, we help multiple investors and we manage their portfolio and we generate for them high returns uh, on sale and rent. To talk about it, that opportunities for investors, we talk about diversity of investment op uh, options in real estate and what's the strategic entry point for investors. So as everyone knows that what's the options that in real estate, either we have residential apartment or uh, villas townhouse, which is residential highly has a huge demand, commercial uh, as well recently this year the rent for commercial it get very increased because there's shortage of uh, offices warehouse and the storage areas and hospitalities where you have the service apartments or the hotels how we help our investors so first of all we ask Two question is what's the what's your purpose of investment? Are you looking for long term investment? Are you looking for resale or you are looking for flip while it's under construction? In the meanwhile, what's the value of your investment? Are you looking to invest half million, one million? That's multi like hundred millions. So what's the value of your investment? Based on this, we are playing the main role as advisory so we are asking you about we providing you location project and what we can provide after we uh, per, let you purchase that project so this is what's mostly demanding and we are asking about it for example we are talking about both we talk about resale uh, of the uh, Two example, we talk about resale the property. So if we are looking for purchasing of 1.5 million value of property, uh, and we plan to sell it after 40%, because the rule is to resell the property, even if it's off the plan, after 40%. Either we sell it before that or after, we let the buyer cover that uh, remaining amount. We will be targeting a 15% profit, of the value or once the property has been hand over we will sell it after with profit of 50 percent which is this is what currently we saw in the market or we are looking for long-term investment where you invest the property you took it we put it for rent that will generate you around maximum eight uh, percent in, in in terms of apartment by in on the other hand, for townhouse, we are talking about 40% yearly on the return of uh, investment. What the upcoming project is happening and highly huge demand. We are talking about in Dubai, Banjabal Ali, Dubai South, Maritime City, the Greek Harbor, and Al Murjan Island in Rasafema, where we'll have the casino. To talk about the regulation and framework, we talk about what's the property ownership law, about the legal framework and uh, tax and fees. To talk about the ownership, 
what type of ownership in UE is available and what the restriction and ownership for foreigners. So we'll talk about the types freehold where you can own your property for lifetime. You don't have restriction on buying, selling property and this in mostly in in new areas of Dubai. This hold is you can own it for 99 per, uh, years. And if you sell it, that would be reduced of the period of time that you, you own it or the previous owner has it. And UE only restriction for UE and GCC area, they can invest in such area, which is the old areas of Dubai. To talk about the restriction, where we talk about terms of ownership type, the different possibility, like either you are like buying in cash or mortgage, and as well where we they added for the past two years, the golden visa for a property you must have on it for the value above two million, but in certain cases you have above one million plus for five years. And in UE, you don't have any restriction to own any uh, property for certain nationality. It's open for all the nationalities. What the legal framework for investment? You have the protection and regulation and the compliance with investment. As well, we're talking about the, the protection and regulation that will save you to make you save your investment in safe hand you have the laws of property ownership you have rural which is the real estate regulation authority you have the property registration you have the mortgage law you have tendency law uh, escrow account that will uh, create by developer to secure their in your investment as investor in off of land you have start you have investor and you have consumer protection law so you have multiple laws that will help you and will make your investment is secure in UAE market. Guidelines on adhering the legal compliance. So we need to understand about the UAE property ownership. Ensure your off of land that has escrow account, which is I mentioned earlier. You need to be aware about the flexible uh, application tax fees, uh, et cetera, payment, and what's your payment schedule because this will will affect your payment schedule. Uh, as well, you need to be informed about in each latest update that happening in the market. You need to verify your documentation in terms of the document details, unit number, location-wise, project-wise, and et cetera. All this will affect later on if it's not correct. You need to review all this and you need to register it and have all this document secure and recorded. About the tax. To know about more about the tax in uh, and the fees that you need to pay as investors and you are entering the UAE in the real estate market, we need to talk about the VAT. VAT is 5%. Uh, that you need to pay in the value of for any uh, actual any unit you need to pay five percent rental income tax we don't have it it's not registered we don't have a rental tax we don't have a capital gain tax on ue market you have a private uh, registration fees which is four percent you need to be aware about this where any transaction you need to pay four percent and you need to pay the VAT 5%. Corporate tax, it has been launched last year of 9% for corporate, for profit only. And we don't have any inheritance tax wealth. So this is the most important fees that you need to be aware about it, the 4% registration and the VAT. And later on, we'll talk about the other fees, agency fees, and etc. To talk more about fees and changing investors, 
that we need to book, talk about. As I told you, property registration fees is only 4% for one time. You have uh, agency fees, 2%, maintenance fees that for a yearly based on uh, your uh, tower or project, you pay it yearly or in, in terms of the payment in your project. Utility, mortgage fees, definitely. Uh, VAT, transfer fees to transfer the ownership, which is the same of property registration fees. Hoodie uh, fee as well when you buy purchasing off a plan. Municipality fees for certain project and property insurance if you want insurance based on the value of your property and location, etc. Exit fees that if you want to exit your property and uh, exit that investment. Legal fees for the legalization and for the lawyer and survey inspection that uh, for third party to, uh, to survey and inspect your property. Actually, this is all over information that you need to have and to be aware about it uh, for uh, real estate investment. So if you have any questions, please uh, raise it to me in my email. And let's start your journey. Invest today. Thank you so much.